Hi guys and welcome to my channel. Today I have a small haul for you. I want to talk decorating inside and out. It's pretty choppy because I'm having to edit a lot because I just I'm so exhausted. I'm really having trouble with my sentences today. Um, so I apologize for that but I hope you enjoy the video. If you do give it a big thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one. Okay so I went to Dollar General. I got the tan and white rug. I loved the way it looked on my floor. I decided I want to pull up every gray and white rug, put down tans, creams, things like that, go in a more neutral direction, which led me into the bathroom. Um, and I decided that I wanted to paint that small half bath downstairs. I'm going to do it in repose gray in a mat because they didn't have the right paint to make a satin. Paints are running low right now for them and that's fine. So I got the Sherwin-Williams Emerald Mat in repose gray. It's SW7015 is the color number. I'm going to do that in, in matte gray um and i'm taking down all of my cows because i have cows in my living room i don't need them in the bathroom too that was just kind of a quick put together um until i decided what i want to do i mean this whole house is pretty much a quick put together um and so i am lately addicted to wickers I've always loved my woods, my blacks, my black metals and things. So I'm going to take you downstairs, actually, and I'm going to show you the items that I've gotten because I'm going to redo my half bath downstairs, paint the walls and repose gray. We'll go downstairs now and I'll show you what else I'm going to do. All right, so here is the tan and white rug that I got. And I just, I really like it. Um, I think it's more neutral. I think it goes well with my floor. I think it needs to be straightened out. That's a, an ending battle between a cat and dog. But anyway, you know, gray and white, that's got to go. That gray and white has to go. That jute will stay there, but the cat likes to scratch on it, so i got to figure something out. But anyway, this started the whole thing of me realizing I wanted to redo my bathroom, which is sounds weird, but just hang with me. So then, you know, I love wicker stuff. Well, I went to, I think I got this at, um, I got this at Target. I got a lighter one, and then I got a darker one that I'm going to take upstairs. I originally got it to hold toilet paper because I had nowhere to keep extra toilet paper. Yes, I went with gray and white. Um, I don't know if I'll keep the gray and white, um, but I got this jar as well. It has a little metal top. It was $7.99 at TJ Maxx Home Goods Mark somewhere that place it doesn't say um so i got that um i got this on clearance from like a home goods tj maxx for like eight bucks it's ceramic breakable it's got some scratches on it so they put it on clearance i'm like wow that sure is distressed i'll take it I got this from at home for 10 bucks. Wash your hands. It's got the black in the woods. I'm going to continue to use this sign. I picked up this sign from Hobby Lobby for like six bucks. You never know what you have until it's gone, like toilet paper. Um, I'm taking out. Uh, the farm print up there, eh, you see it? That's going. Oh, shit. 
Are y'all okay? All right, so I'm taking out this and this. The shelves that I had there are now down there. I'm taking out all of those cows. I'm taking out that plastic, you know, 99 cent thing I got probably at the dollar store. I'm adding in these browns, blacks, wickers. I've got this wicker basket. I got it from Target for 20 bucks. It has the plastic thing inside of it. I just added a little bag and we'll do that. So then to go above the toilet, I have these shelves. Dog, please stop. I have these shelves that I'm going to hang after I paint and put the little decor on it. Now, I have people like, you know, my daughters or younger women that visit. I'll probably put, you know, female products in there and stuff like that. This is the darker one that I got right here. Sorry. It's the sun. Um, I got this basket to go on here somewhere, somehow. I got a hearth and hand to go on it. I got this wicker candle holder at Kirkland's for like six bucks. It was on sale. It has glass in it. I can take that glass out and get like a um, three wick Better Homes and Gardens in there, but I can't get a Bath and Body Works in there. So I'm trying to decide exactly how I want to use this. I might just use it and put it on top. Please don't knock the other one down. I need to slow down. Being too spastic. So I might do something like that on top. I don't know yet. We'll do all of that this weekend. None of that is happening today because I am exhausted. And um, I just wanted to send out a quick video to you to let you know where I've been, what's going on. I'm going to be doing fall decorating. Um, I just... Duke, come on. I just want to... He's chewing up the paper towels. I mean, the... Stop! The napkins. I just wanted to get a quick video out to you guys and just say the next project we'll have is the bathroom. Oh, and... The last thing. Okay, so after I paint, I'm going to remove, you know, all of this hardware, put a new one up, take down that. That was just a joke being silly because I knew I would redo this the way I want it. Um, after I paint, hang my shelves, do all of that, the last project we will be doing together is I will be installing... bag to send it in. Installing this. It is a, it is a, whatever these are called. It is a faucet. So, um, I've got this and then I've got, you know, the plate that'll cover up where the current one is. And then I got the drain, which will be black as well. So, um, that will be the very last thing we'll do, is the black hardware, and I hope it looks the way I think it's going to look. So, Saturday is going to be kind of a rainy day, stay in the house type of day, and Sunday is going to be beautiful, and I have to get outside. So, look for the, the bathroom rehaul to be done on Saturday. Turn on your notifications. If you are excited to watch me redo this bathroom, give this video a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Um, if I've forgotten to, you know, put where any of this is from, it's time for me to go. My brain is fried. I'm tired. I've been working in the office, traveling, working, right? Just trying to get used to that whole thing again. Um, and, yeah, I can't, I need to, like, take it easy. <laughs> So, I will see you in the next video, and until then, I hope you are well, my friend. Bye.